the Jones County Sheriff's Department has arrested a 14-year-old male after he allegedly made a threat on social media to commit an act of violence at South Jones High School. 12 News' Deidre Briscoe spoke with leaders in Jones County. The former South Jones High School student has been arrested and is being detained at the Jones County Juvenile Detention Facility. Investigators say they were alerted on Saturday of the online end of school year threat, and it took them one hour and 45 minutes to bring the juvenile into custody. Officials say any and all threats are taken seriously. As uh, Sheriff Berlin said on Saturday, January 8th, he forwarded a message to me that was taken off of social media in reference to a possible threat to South Jones High School. The threat stated that a shooting was going to happen. It was dated from May 25th of 2022. The threat was towards the students and faculty of South Jones. The student was pulled from school in October and was not currently enrolled. The superintendent says while this is not the first time a threat has been made within their school district, it is still a shock. Unfortunately, uh, social media has lent itself to things being um, uh, done like this before. Uh, it is always a shock, though. It never, uh, you know, it is. It, it is a shock. Students were the ones who saw the threat online and alerted their parents, according to the Jones County Sheriff's Office. Now the superintendent says he wants to encourage kids to say something if they see something. Uh, they felt comfortable enough bringing that forward, and we really appreciate them to do that because, you know, you always hear the horror stories about people seeing things but not saying anything and things like that. And so um, they're a vital role in all of our crisis management issues, but especially in cases like this when it's dealing with social media and that type of thing. Due to the minor's arrest, administrators felt no need to cancel school. Administrators say the May 25th threat coincides with the last day of school, but it is unclear why the student singled out that day. The initial appearance in front of Judge Wayne Thompson is set for this week. Reporting in Jones County, Deidre Briscoe, 12 News.